during halftime of Saturday's football game. Seven finalists were selected by an interview process and a general student vote. Live correspondent Angelica Brackens is in the muck with this year's winners. Thanks, Kelly. I'm here with Brennan Chemland and Alyssa Van Meteren, who were just crowned Mr. and Miss Dakota Days <coughs> this Saturday at halftime at the Dome. Thanks for joining us, guys. Can you tell me how it felt like when you guys got crowned? Yeah, it was, it was pretty surreal. It was, I mean, you're standing on this field and you're looking up at all of these people in red and it's kind of intimidating. And then when they say your name, you're just like, oh my gosh, it was, it was cool. How about you, Brennan? Um, I, I mean, it, it goes so fast that you're just kind of like, oh, I'm, I'm now meeting the Brokaws. I'm now meeting, you know, the governor. And um, it's just a really cool thing to be able to be that person that represents the whole university. Can you tell me about some of the things that you guys did over D-Days? Yeah, I mean, the Dakota Days Planning Committee does such a good job of doing all of these events. And I think, you know, we sort of saw it as our responsibility, not just us, but all the candidates, to go to all these events and sort of to rally the, studi the students through that. Um, and so, yeah, I definitely participated in all of that, as well as hanging out with the alumni that came back. That's always my favorite part. I think one of the coolest things was being um, in the parade with the other uh, top 14 candidates and being able to um, kind of show everyone, like, this is what we're here for. We're here to be um, representatives of USD and um, just so that the whole community can see that. Why do you think you guys got picked over everyone else? Well, I think what Dakota Days ultimately represents is <laughs> It's a celebration. It's a celebration of this school. And I think Mr. and Ms. Dakota are supposed to be um, the people who are who are the most passionate about USD, and I think that's that's definitely true for both of us. I mean, we love this school and and care about it so much. And, and I think for both of us, we've kind of tried to do so much work in the past three years um, for this university, for the community, and I think that um, it really pays off when you can you know say to someone like, yes, the students chose us, and we, they chose mm -hmm. us for a reason. So. So thank you. Thanks again to Alyssa and Brennan, live from the muck. I'm Angelica Brackens. Thanks, Angelica.